Born This Way Foundation has teamed up with the National Council of Behavioral Health. We are uh, in eight different schools, but we are expanding and we're going to add 20 more very soon. And I'm excited to meet the kids. I am so in awe of your bravery. It's not easy to face our mental health. Uh, and it's something that has a heavy stigma around it. And by you guys taking part in this program, you're changing the world. It was really helpful for me because like, I, was act I actually like, ended up like, speaking up and like, talking to my teacher like, privately about something. And, and like, it's changed my life. If this were to spread across the country, how much that no statistic of suicides for teenagers could go down is incredible to think about. And it's a really a beautiful step. For me, quite frankly, my dream is that this happens in every school. And I'm just so proud of all of you. And if you wouldn't mind, I'd like to ask you for two things. One, would you please come to my show tonight? <laughs> Number two, I would love to invite you all to come up on stage when I sing Million Reasons. What's the first thing that you do in school when you are practicing your mental health first aid? Look. How about third? You ask, then you listen, and then you get help from an adult. With team mental health first aid, we like to say, it's okay to not be okay. Sometimes when life gives you a million reasons not to want to stay, you need just one good person that looks at you, listens to you, helps you get help, and validates how you feel. Tell them what you need. My name's Katie. Yeah, Katie. That's Katie, and Katie's brave. Two, I have post-traumatic stress disorder. Woo! And I wrote this song about it. I got my head stuck in the side of all the love and I still It's like that I stopped breathing but completely aware that you can't.